last class I was talking about the uh, transition temperature charts that is Heisler charts. I was solving some problem on uh, uh, slab. I think I'll go to a problem directly, and I using uh, this uh, uh, Heisler charts. I tried solving uh, this problem that is five centimeter thick iron plate uh, conductivity sixty watt per meter Kelvin and uh, CP value density value is given alpha value is given initially it is at 225 suddenly both surfaces are exposed to the ambient air at uh, 25 degree with a heat transfer coefficient of 500 watt per meter square calculate the entire temperature the center temperature at t is equal to 2 minutes after the start of cooling and another uh, pro the condition that is given calculate the temperature at a depth of 1 centimeter from any one of the surface either left or right surface at the two start of 2 minutes Remotely, start of uh, uh, two minutes and uh, at uh, at one centimeter from the any one of the surface or left or right you can calculate and uh, lastly you have to calculate the energy removed from the plate per square meter during the this time and uh, the length is uh, 2L and L is equal to 2.5 centimeter because L plus L are the center temperature and uh, you are already uh, given in the uh, data and book. If you go there in the data and book, you will be experiencing that what is the geometry that he is considering. Okay. From this first you have to calculate the four years uh, uh, value. It means uh, in this graph here is a four year number. Just I am showing that and this is the four years number. This four year number is alpha tau by L, alpha tau by L. This you have to calculate first. Alpha tau by L, alpha T by L square you have taken, and that is equal to 3.1. From the figure, tau is equal to 3.1, that is uh, four years number is equal to 3.1. One by byat is taken, but uh, here it is taken directly the byat number. Byat number which I calculate is. Uh, 0 0.2088. This number you have to take. The which I calculated 1 by byte. This is directly byte number. What is that? This is 0 0.2. 0 0.2 means 0 0.2 line is this. Look at here. This I am going to draw it by highlighter. And this is the line. 0 0.2 line. Okay. This is the line you have to consider. From 4 year number is equal to 3.1. You have to select 3.1 because it is a, a graphical representation and uh, we have to take uh, a logarithmic scale and because it is a large number variation is there. So for that 3.1 is a small variation you have to take like this you have to come up till it intersect with the byat number line is equal to 0 0.2088 from the book data and book that is given. After that turn left till you it touches the value of T0 infinity T0 minus T infinity divided by T initial temperature minus T infinity is equal to 0.58. That's what you have taken. This value you have to obtain by calculating by at number and four year number. I can get the temperature distribution value. So why? How do you get? Uh, yeah. So now the temperature distribution is uh, 0 0.58. You have to substitute. I want to calculate the initial uh, the after time T is equal to two minutes. What is the temperature T0? The base temperature. So already time is inbuilt in this because time 2 minutes I have taken here, 2 into 60 I have taken. That is the time given. At this time, what is the temperature of the base? T0 is equal to T infinity plus T initial temperature minus T infinity. Substituting uh, initial temperature 25 and the, uh, the ambient temperature 25, initial temperature 225 and you will have to find out the base temperature at after 2 minutes. So that is equal to 141 degrees Celsius. This is the calculation you have to do. So the temperature of uh, uh, slab at 1 centimeter from the uh, surface is determined. X by L value you have to take. Why X by L value is required? I will go to the graph first you have to see. This is the X by L. No, no, suddenly it is script 1. Number is there I think. No, it is not there.
so it is merged one over the other i don't know why what is happening that is x by l value similarly you have to calculate the x by l value x by l value is this graph it means another graph i have to take in page number 67 it is page number 66 i don't know how it has merged here they both the graphs have got merged here okay right anyhow i am i am keep checking 67 is there i think Now, this is behind there is a graph with this graph. So, I go and edit and upload once again. Wait, I will go and upload once again. Yeah, this. This will keep aside. I will once again upload so that you can see the at least one problem I correctly can solve so that you can also It's got overlapped. That is why I'm just deleting that file and then I'm uploading a new file after removing this because I want to show that graph. That is x by l. It means position graph. How the uh, one centimeter away from the one surface, what will be the temperature distribution? How to calculate the temperature after one minute? Uh, that is one centimeter in the depth of the and the center. So this is the center temperature already determined. So, 1 centimeter from one surface, this is 1 centimeter. So, what will be the temperature at this point? You have to find out. So, that is what uh, from the start of cooling, what will be the temperature at 1 centimeter? For that, you need to calculate x by l value. x by l value you have to take, and from that graph, you can calculate. I think it will take a lot of time to load it. Before that last step, I am going to show you. Okay, after that, you will take up that. So, this is another uh, uh, calculation that I am going to see. The, what is the amount of heat transfer? After two minutes, that you are going to, third step, you are going to solve. First, you have to calculate the Fourier number. By at number square into Fourier number. That you have to multiply, you will get 0.137. See, on log scale, you have to take the by at number is equal to 0.21. This is the by at number is equal to 0.21. So, this is the uh, scale of, sorry, this is the 0 0.21 uh, byat number scale. So, here I calculated and uh, the byat square tau is 0 0.21 square into 3.1 you will get 0 0.317. So, the 0 0.317 I have taken here. After cutting this, you will get uh, 0.45. So, using this, uh, the, the non-dimensional uh, heat ratio, I got to calculate So this I calculated. You know, I to let to, I to open this. I'm not getting it. I think. 
third step that I am going to calculate here, look at this, y at number x by l is 0 0.6 from the graph I have taken this is equal to 0 0.95, from that your temp you calculate the temperature of 135.2 later I will show the heat loss from the plate per square meter including both sides during the transient up to 2 minutes determine the heat rate that is y at number is equal to 0 0.21 and y at square into Fourier number is 0.317 using these two values that is y at number and then four year uh, this combination of y at square and four year you will get a the non dimensional heat uh, uh, transfer ra ratio is equal to 0.45 so therefore q naught is equal to how much is heat last is mcp delta t mass is equal to rho into the volume rho into volume 2 l into a and cp into temperature difference that you have to take from that you are going to calculate uh, the amount of heat lost because of the change in temperature and it start dissipating heat to the surrounding or the the whatever the fluid which you have quenched that is going to be taken so the heat lost from the slab per square meter in two minutes uh, it becomes q into 0.45 into q naught that is 15.9 into 10 raised to 6 joule so it can be expressed in kilojoule removing the three zeros you will get 15.9 into 10 raised to 3 kilojoule. I don't know why it is not floating. I will try once again after removing this. I don't know how to delete this also. So, I come back once again. Please permit me that I will go once again. I will come back. I will re-login once again. one I have to delete yes it is loaded From desktop only you can uh, I don't know, start sharing desktop. Directly I will go from desktop because it is, takes a lot of time uh, in loading that. I don't know whether it is visible or not. Desktop sharing I have taken. From this I am going to just uh, up and this graph I am going to show you. So this is what I am going to, I am not able to uh, see till it uh, gets so x by l values x is uh, 2.5 centimeter as uh, the total thickness minus of 1 centimeter from one side that you have to minus it then divided by l is 2.5 you will get 0 0.6 so therefore you take 0 0.6 is here so this is a 0.6 value so but from 0 0.6 and uh, four year number that is y at number is equal to y at number is xl by k that is equal to 0 0.2 from that you take here you will get uh, 0.95 temperature distribution is equal to 0.95 from that you are going to take it let me come back and see whether it is load loaded or not it is taking a lot of time okay i'll go from this only yeah i'm able to see this Today class, I think I am not able to complete uh, because of this problem. 
why it is not downloading any all i desktop sharing is there whether you are visible or not i don't know but i am going to deliver lecture like this so this is uh, the value that i am going to calculate and uh, and here x by l is equal to 0.6 and y number is equal to 0.2 this is one by y already previously i calculated by using a different graph that i am going to take it that is uh, t minus t infinity dot by t not minus t infinity is equal to 0.95 so from that you can calculate the what is the temperature at this point at uh, the so there you will get uh, 135.12 uh, uh, degrees celsius that is the heat loss from the plate per square meter including both side during the transient up to temperature uh, sorry time t is equal to 2 minute and you have to determine the heat flow that already i shown you this is how we have to uh, determine and you have to take the ratio that q not is equal to where the amount of heat loss to the surrounding is uh, mcp delta t that is uh, uh, energy equation so mass is equal to sigma into the area multiplied by the length of the slab area into cross sectional area perpendicular to board in per per perpendicular to the board into length of the slab you will get uh, uh, the volume volume into density is the mass into specific heat at constant pressure is 26 into 1 uh, that uh, we have to take uh, temperature difference between the initial temperature and the ambient temperature and multiplying that that is a maximum temperature difference multiplying that you will get the amount of energy lost or the heat lost per square meter from the slab in 2 minutes so therefore the heat loss from slab per square meter in 2 minutes becomes q is equal to 0.45 times q not you will get 15.9 into 10 raised to 6 see the problems which are going to be asked are similar in nature that you can take it and then uh, do away with that problem so say another uh, this uh, students those who are referring those who are referring the wozasek book wozasek is given for determining the dimensionless quantity x by l q by 0 by heisler chart represented graphically like this this is the graph that i have taken this is mid plane and this is one one side of the slab and another side of the slab cross sectional area perpendicular to the board at this multiplied by 2l gives the volume so therefore 1 by b at is equal to 4 4.8 line is this 1 by y at number 4.8 and 4 year number is equal to 3.1 from this you have to take uh, the value of temperature distribution that is 0.58 so from this also we can calculate the t after 2 minutes it means a temperature distribution after 2 minutes at this point okay this value you have to determine the base temperature this is one another is the how you are going to calculate the sometimes from this graph you are calculating You will get x by l is equal to 0.6. This is x by l value is 0.6 value, and 1 by y is 4.8. From this, you can take the temperature distribution is equal to 0.98. So little error from graph to graph it is there. I think 10% error is allowed. The answers are if it is varying from uh, 1% to 10% is allowed, and we are not giving or deducting any marks for this. So you can directly calculate this. and you can calculate the temperature distribution also here the heat non dimensional heat flow ratio that you have to calculate by this graph again i'll enlarge it and uh, this graph you have to take by art square into tau that is 0.31 this is the by art number line 0.2 and then from this 0.31 line you have to go like this and then wherever you get the q by q not is equal to 0.45 you can calculate this is another way of calculating because uh, some students may use the uh, different graphs but the procedure remains same instead of by at you are calculating one by by that's what you are going to do it let me see whether it is uh, uploaded or no it is not uploaded till i log out and come back again uh, it's very difficult for me to uh, see this